Hi everybody and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to take a look at the Roku Streaming Stick 4K. Take a fast look at what's inside and how to set it up. Stay tuned. It's time for streaming. So a fast look to see what was inside the box. You have your Roku remote, the Roku Stick, you have the plug that goes into the wall along with some batteries for the remote and the USB cable to plug into the power block and into the Roku stick. I'm going to hook all that up and then I'll be back and we'll go ahead and set up the Roku 4K stick. Hi everybody, so let's get started on how to set up a Roku streaming 4K stick. I'm going to select on the remote OK for English. Now it's going to go ahead and scan for my Wi-Fi networks. After the update, it brings you to the screen where it says set display type. I'm going to choose continue with 1080p. I'm going to hit OK on the Roku remote. Now it's going to say your Roku remote can control the power and volume of your TV. Check remote settings. Click on OK. Now you need to go ahead and type in the brand of the TV that you have, which I'm going to do. After you type in the brand of the TV that you have, it's asking is the music playing? I'm going to say yes it is. Do you still hear the music? Yes. Is the music still playing? Yes. Is it playing now? I click on no because it has stopped. Success! Your Roku remote is set up to control this TV's power and volume. I'm going to say OK. Now you need to activate your Roku player. You have to go ahead and click on OK to enter in your email address. I am going to do this now and then I will come back. Once you type in your email address, it's going to say activate your Roku player. Please check your inbox, which I'm going to do now. Once you check your email, it's going to ask you to activate now. You click on the button that says activate now and it will bring you to this place where it says create your Roku account, which I'm going to do now. Make sure you fill out all the information, your first name, last name, create a password, date of birth, your gender, and then agree to the terms and then say, I am not a robot, and then we will click on continue. Once you put your name in and email address, it's going to say name your device. I'm going to name my device Stream and Stick 4K. What room? I'm going to say guest bedroom. Click on I have read and agree to the Roku products terms of use. Click on continue. Now it's going to set, set up Roku Pay. I'm not going to do this, but if you want, you can. It's good too if you want to subscribe to streaming services or buy and rent movies. I'm going to skip this option, so I'm scrolling down to the bottom and say skip this step. Next, do you pay for cable or satellite TV? Yes, I will click on yes. Select your cable provider. Scroll through, see if yours is listed. If not, use the drop down arrow to select your provider. I'm going to do that, then click continue, and then I'll be back. After you have chosen your provider, it's going to ask do you currently subscribe to any of these services? Scroll through them, choose the ones that you do. I do Discovery Plus, and I will click on continue. Let's build your channel lineup. I like free movies and TV. I like sports, food and home, music. I like local news. And now we'll go ahead and click on continue. Add more channels to your Roku home. Scroll through and see which ones you want to add to your home screen and just click on the add button for you. I will click on Peacock, Pluto TV I like. I also like local now. I will click on that. Foursome, I will click on that one also. QVC, and I will go down a couple more to see. Sling TV, I like. I will click on Add for that one. And then after that, I will click on Continue. Now it's going to go ahead and put all my channels into a whole group for me. Now, there's other things you can do. You can sign up instantly and cancel any time. These are offers. You do not have to choose these. Just go ahead. There's seven day free trials. 
Just go ahead and scroll all the way down to the bottom and then say continue if you don't want to choose any of those. The next step you want to do is go ahead and click on install to put the Roku app onto your phone. I will do that now. Once you have the app on your phone, it will look like this. And you could go ahead and scroll through and find different types of shows that you want to watch. Now back on the Roku streaming 4K stick, it says everything is done. Go ahead and click on OK on your remote. Once you move forward onto the Roku streaming stick 4K, it's going to bring you to the home screen. You could click down on the directional pad on what to watch, featured free, live TV, the buzz, you can search for shows, the movie store, TV store, streaming channels, my food, settings, and then back to home. There is tons and tons of stuff to watch on here, and the quality is outstanding. I hope you find this video very helpful to you. Please like and subscribe and click on that bell because there will be more videos on what to do with your Roku device. And remember, day or night, it's time for streaming.